what's going on? Joe Coffey here for PremierGuitar.com. We're at Nashville NAM 2009, and uh, you know TV Jones. You're all familiar with the Filtertron pickups. There's some new stuff now too, and uh, Tom Jones is going to tell you about it. Tom, how you doing, man? Good. How you doing? Good. Good. So check out these guitars, right. man. Take us through it. We have three versions of this Model 10 guitar. The first is the most simple version: two pickups and, and regular tailpiece. This guitar weighs between six and seven pounds and is available in four colors. This is the ice blue, metallic. Over here we have the red, crimson red, flat black, and a toffee burst. If you notice, all the finish on this guitar is uh, satin. All these components are aluminum. Just want to keep the guitar light. It's a solid body. The, the wood is called obichi. It's a, a, a wood from Africa. Very cool. Uh, I'm trying to give people an idea uh, who can't see it in person here from, from the camera. Yep. Uh, scale length, it kind of looks Dano. Scale length is a standard 24 and 5 eighths. Okay. Um, I was going to show you these, a so Bixby version with two pickups. That's a B5 Bixby. And we have the last version here on the end. This is the one pickup version with a tone switch. There is a cavity under the pick guard in case anybody wants to upgrade with a new pick guard, a pickup, and a new harness. The, um, the guitars with the Bigsby, they weigh as, as much as eight. They're usually about seven or eight pounds. All right. So this guitar is about three weeks old. Love the burst. Oh yeah, yeah that's my favorite. These look sexy, man. These are very Yeah, cool. very light, feel how light that is. Yeah, that's that's surprisingly one of, light. Yeah. And they're, they're not chambered. Huh. Uh, what should people know about uh, pricing? Um, between, to see, the street price of $1,400 for the single pickup, $1,625, I believe, for the double pickup, and the Bixby is uh, $1,750, I believe. I, I don't have the prices because they're so new in front of me. So $1,400, $1,600, or $1,700. All right, also new from TV Jones, you've got a P90, right? Oh, man, I'm so excited about this. <laughs> Our new P90 pickups. I've incorporated the larger Gretsch pole screws, which we make ourselves, and the larger Gretsch quarter-inch magnets. So what I got from this pickup is more inductance. And uh, I notice a lot of dynamics, a lot of growl, very thick single notes. The neck version has a standard Alnico 4 Gibson sized magnets, nice and clear and warm. So I have a I have a guitar set up with these pickups if you'd like to hear it. Yeah, let's check it out. You know, it's interesting as far as industry trends go, you know, we all have P90s, but these days we're seeing a lot of people come out with a, a bridge P90. That's cool that you did that. Yeah, bridge P90s are really difficult. They can sound very thin. So I was after in more inductance, a thicker tone, but a lot of clarity. Here's the neck pickup. Both pickups. You lower the volume, they remain very clear and clean. I'm happy with the dynamics and the the clarity and the and the and the and the, and the, the fat treble strings. Really. So it's our new pickup. What should people know about pricing? This pickup uh, in the neck position is 95 uh, map price, street price, 105 for the bridge. Um, this design is also available in the standard Filtertron cavity or mount. So do um, you see it in the? standard P90 soap bar version, black and cream. If people want to find out more, where can they go online? TVJones.com. Right. Tom, thanks a lot, man. You're welcome. Appreciate it. I'm Joe Coffey. You're watching PremierGuitar.com.